finally tonight, she's out of this world. The current commander of the International Space Station about to break a big record tonight. Here's ABC's Gio Benitez. They call it the Peggy Factor, Mission Control's code word for the way superstar astronaut Peggy Whitson always gets the job done. I love it up here. Tonight, Commander Whitson making history with her record for any American. By the time she lands in September, her tally will be 666 days in space, with more spacewalks, currently eight, than any other female astronaut. She says what matters is the mission. I'm not here because of the record, but I, I think having the record is important because we have to continue to progress. We have to continue to take the next steps. Whitson is perhaps a surprising interstellar star. At nine, growing up on a farm in Iowa, she watched the moon landing and her dream was born. You know, at the time, young girls weren't supposed to do those kinds of things. She persevered, earning a PhD in biochem and landing a job with NASA, then overcoming the long odds. It was 10 years before NASA decided she she had the right stuff to become an astronaut. Her favorite thing about being in space, simply seeing the Earth, from North Africa's reds to the Caribbean blues from so far away. We need to do more to be one, one Earth, one people. Gio Benitez, ABC News, New York. And tonight, Peggy Whitson tweeting her gratitude from space, saying it's one of the rides you hope never ends. We, of course, wish her a safe return in late summer. Thanks so much for watching tonight. I'm Tom Yamas in New York. GMA, first thing in the morning. David Muir, right back here tomorrow night. Have a great evening. Good night.